He was reaching for his wallet and the officer just shot him in his arm. Philando Castile was shot dead as he reached for his driver's license. He'd been ordered to produce it by a police officer. Moments before, he'd been stopped for having a broken taillight. He told the officer he was carrying a legally licensed gun. You told him to get his ID. The questions asked at the protests that followed are, would a white driver pulled over end up being shot dead in front of his girlfriend and her child while complying with an officer's instructions? Would he even have been stopped in the first place for such a minor infraction and is a black man not allowed to claim the constitutional right to legally own a gun that politicians here and elsewhere in the country say is so important ever since Castile's girlfriend Diamond Reynolds live streamed the aftermath of his shooting many more questions have been asked why was the officer still waving his gun through the car window after he shot Castile while shouting in an apparent panic why wasn't he given immediate medical help and why was Reynolds cuffed and detained along with her four-year-old child? They were separated overnight. She explained why she filmed the aftermath of the shooting. Because I wanted everybody in the world to see what the police do and how they roll, and it's not right. It's not acceptable. I didn't do it for pity. I didn't do it for fame. I did it so that the world knows that these police are not here to protect and serve us. They are here to assassinate us. They are here to kill us because we are black. The governor has called for a federal investigation. I promise that I will do everything and my administration will do everything in our power. You see that this matter is brought to justice. What they're also saying here is they've had enough of saying enough is enough. In fact, some community leaders are openly wondering whether the white political class is trying to, in their words, start some kind of war. In addition, there's no faith in any investigation, any official investigation, no matter who does it, because the guidelines are clear. If an officer says he or she feels under threat, they're allowed to shoot. Diamond Reynolds spoke for the protesters when she said this. Now they have to pay. I will not be able to sleep until I get justice. I need justice. I need peace. I want justice. I want peace. I want justice. And even after justice, this will never go away. Reynolds live stream ensured international coverage of Castile's death. However, there is a recognition here that had she not streamed it, there wouldn't have been any coverage, or perhaps at the most, a line in the local paper. Black man shot by police. Authorities say he was armed. Shia Al Jazeera, St. Paul.